Hello, all you lovely folk out there. What's going on? I'm Babadap, and we are supposed to. Whoa. It's like when people are like far off in the distance, their frames are like super low. But anyway, it's alright. This is a cool game. We're not going to acknowledge that all, uh, too often. Nanny Hoozle, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. Um, we're supposed to talk to someone. We got to talk to Lofaset while we for Eleanor. But we're not going to talk to Lofaset. We're going to talk to Rokuro. Man. Artorius and Nominat. Either one of them's a force to be reckoned with. Then why do you look so happy? Because I'm still alive. And if I'm alive, I can fight. You're certainly... optimistic. That's just the sort of demon I am. What about you, though? You gonna call that whole revenge thing off? If only. That's just the sort of demon I'm not. Then we need to find a way to beat them. You can mope after you're dead. We? You're still going to help? Yeah. After all, I wouldn't be here if Lafayette hadn't saved my life. Surely you know me by now. I might not look it, but duty and honor flow through my veins. I like you, Rokuro. You don't, uh... You're not scared of anything. I like that. You're, that's, a, that's a man right there, guys. Take notes. Take notes. Anyway, I do want to talk over cutscenes now because... La there was one episode where there was literally no gameplay or any commentary. I mean, there was a little bit, I'm sure, but nah, it was just too much. So, I might talk over cutscenes now, because no more of that. No more of that. That was, that was terrible. I mean, I could have gone longer at the uh, episodes, but, ah, uh, I don't know. Anyway, let's talk to this guy. And hopefully, I have something to react to. A demon... A Moloch, a witch, and now an exorcist. We've turned into a real band of misfits. I That's didn't band, have any other choice. We're stuck with her. Yeah, I know. We can't afford to lose Lafayette. Now that we know the full extent of Inominat's strength, we need that boy more than ever. Do you think Inominat really is an Empyrean? You got me. But I do know this. Whatever he is, he's no ordinary Moloch. And the Abbey intends on using that power. To what end, I couldn't say. If we're going to win this, we need to uncover Inominat's true nature and the Abbey's secret goals. Indeed. At the very least, I think we can safely assume that Eifried's disappearance is part of their schemes. We might be able to extract some information out of that Eleanor woman as well. Agreed. But no torture. I'm not shattering our only vessel. Yeah, I get that. Given the pact they share, if Eleanor goes down, Lafayette becomes a demon, right? What? No one told me that! That's just how it is between Moloch and Vessel. I know she's a threat, but we need to keep her close for the time being. Well, we sure are in a deep now. <laughs> We're in deep doo-doo, guys. Alright, I'm 12. Let's do this! Let's talk to Lafayette. Wait, you're not Lafayette. Where's Lafayette? He's outside, isn't he? Who are you? Wow, yeah, you know what, speaking of which, it must be really terrible to have, like, a, a bond fever, and then, what, what, at the beginning of spring, because allergies, and then you gotta deal with that? Man, just your body would just be so confused what to deal with first. I can handle it, because I don't really have allergies that much. I probably have, I, no, I, I think I get allergies, like, between summer and fall, and that's about it. But anyway, let's go find Love Set, shall we? Love Set. Where are you at, you little bench? You lovely, you lovely little forker? Virginia Ravine. Uh, no, ravines are nice. Oh, there's an enemy here. We can take him out, right? I'm alone, right? Am I alone? Fork. What's the button to do? Shut up. What's the button? There's the button. All right, yeah, we're alone. You guys think I, you guys think I can take on that monster over there alone? I think I can. I believe myself. That's why. I know I'm not going to lose. You know what's play uh that one game Naruto? I I don't know why I like that line so much. It's, well I guess I don't really like it. It's just I don't know. It's a it's a good line I guess. Well look at that thing flying over there. Look at those things flying. All those things over there. 
Man, okay, yeah, you know what? I'm not gonna go over there alone. I'm gonna bring Lovesay with me. Hey, don't overwork yourself. I'm sorry. Why are you apologizing? Isn't it obvious? I... I disobeyed you, Velvet. Don't sweat it. I'm still alive thanks to you. I just... I didn't want to see you die. That's why I... Why I did that. To save you. I'm sorry too. Acting the way I did. Treating you like an object. When I came with you, that was my own choice. You gave me the freedom to choose. And what would you choose now? We only have more troubles ahead. You're still going to fight, aren't you? Yeah, I can't stop now. Even so, I've made my choice. I'm coming with you. I see. Anyway... It's not like I have any idea where we are now. That's a good point. Ahaha! Ah but an object misused is one thing. A person misused is quite another. <laughs> Milo, get out of here! What's your point? What's your point, is what I want to know. Not only did you blow the whole revenge thing, you didn't even leave a scratch. Do you have any plan on where to go from here? I'll admit it. You know me not's power is far beyond what I could ever have imagined. But I'll never give up. No matter how many times I have to try, I'll devour them all. Bet you 100 gold you break first. <laughs> huh? You heard me. 100 gold says that you give up. I lost a bet with Rokuro when you had to go and survive! Cost me ten gold! I'm just looking to come out on top. Whatever, fine. Oh, then it looks like we have a bet. There might be some fun in me sticking around after all. Not that I much care how it all turns out. I'm just looking to kill time. Hey, Velvet. I've got something that might help with Inominat. Oh. Is this that book you took from the villa? It is. Look closely at the crest on the cover. It's the same one from the temple. Does that book say anything about Inominat? Yes. But I can't read it. It's written in the ancient tongue. Oh, don't cry, baby boy. My friend Grimoire might be able to decipher that for you. Really? Well, maybe, maybe not. She'd have to take a look first. Well, where is she? Your friend, I mean. No idea. The last letter I got from her was sent from Isolt down in South Gand. Not much to work with here. True, but I'll have fun watching you try. Oh, I'll find her. Don't you worry about that. That's the spirit. Don't give up just yet. She just wants her money. But you know, I was thinking, what's, the, what's so bad about... Tin, uh, Tin Gal, you know? Because, uh, hold on a second. I'm pretty sure I can look at our money right now. Yeah, our Gal is at, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's Gal, right? Or did you say Gald? Whatever. It's 30, oh, we have 30k. Inside these ruins. You're still weak. We, oh yeah, we had to go back to everybody and say, Hey, what's up guys? This guy feels an okie dokie. Is, is it just gonna like uh, zoom over like days of being inside the ruins without water or sleep? Well, we're demons, right? We don't need that. We don't need that garbage. We don't need to live. We already we're already dead. But yeah, I'm, uh, all right. I'll, I'll I'll check with her in a second. All right, cool. Let's do this. Oh, rest. 
I can just rest right here, are you serious? Well, click. Well, might as well rest up now. Three weeks later. Of all the things, a damned demon watching over me. How could I have let this happen? I'm such a disgrace. I'm gonna change her outfit. Cause she's one of us now. <laughs> uh oh. To atone for this grave sin. Oh no. Eleanor? Eleanor! A deal's a deal! Control your emotions, binge. I mean, ma'am, miss. This is all I can do. Forgive what? me, Lord Artorius. All right, hang, hang on a second. What the fork? We weren't asleep at all. <laughs> we knew. This light. It's Melchior's communication art. I send Melchior to check out the Earth Pulse. And what a strange sight does he find. My lord, I have failed you. Lift your head, Eleanor. The Shepherd has a special mission for you. Oh my god. A special mission? You are to protect the Malak Lafiset and bring him to the Logris Abbey headquarters. Oh my god. This mission is highly classified and not to be shared with even the Legates. Protect the Malak and bring him to the capital then? With the utmost secrecy, your becoming his vessel is in fact quite fortunate. Son Maybe of a bitch. so, but with me as his vessel, the Malak may interfere. This Malak may have his own will, but he can be manipulated. Do whatever it takes to get the job done, Eleanor. You act under my full authorization. Even were it to mean obeying the orders of a demon? But my lord, what Malak could possibly be that valuable? Uh, life set. Duh. You listening, binge? I'm sorry, you're, not, you're a nice girl. Lady. Shame is only a fleeting emotion. It is will and reason that ultimately prevail in the face of calamity. My lord, I live to serve the principles of your teachings. The Earth Pulse will soon close. From here on. You must use your own discretion to execute your mission. Nope, I don't care. She's a binge. They heard every word. Eisen is so cool! Oh my gosh! How are you feeling? I'm fine. Listen. Don't try anything like that again. Pain is... Pain is scary, right? I'm alright. No more running away. I'm Lafisen. It's good to finally meet you properly, Eleanor. I yeah, likewise. Sup? Don't worry. If you try running, you won't get far. Once I've eaten your arms and legs, I merely need you alive to act as his vessel. Nothing more. That won't be necessary. I swore an oath before our duel. An oath grants power in exchange for a certain constraint. Mine was, if I lose, I will obey my opponent. Once put in motion, an oath cannot be broken by the one who swore it. I will keep my promise to you because I must. Hmm. An oath, is it? In that case, I have a question for you. 
What does the Abbey plan to do with the Nominat? To wipe out the demons, of course. We want to end the era of disaster once and for all. And how exactly does the Abbey plan on wiping out the demons? Is the Nominat going to wander the land, slaughtering them all? They... they never told me. And Nominat's ritual is kept confidential even within the Abbey. All I know is that it involves Melchior. And it looks like the only way we'll figure out Inominat's true nature is by deciphering Lafayette's book. We'll have to track down Magui's friend, the one who can read the ancient tongue. If we go to Isult in Southgand, we ought to find some clues to her whereabouts. But first, we have to figure out where we are now. We need to find a settler or a village. Something. <laughs> I'm surprised us chuckleheads even know our own names. Even the greatest scholars don't know everything at first. You can't get answers without asking for them. <laughs> Fair enough. Hard to argue with that. I've never seen a Moloch quite like him. Eleanor, your job is going to be to protect Lafayset, even if it brings you into conflict with other exorcists. Because if you turn on me... I know. Like I said, I can't betray you. Listen, Lafayset. If she makes any strange moves, we want you to stop her immediately, okay? I don't think Eleanor is such a bad person. Besides, she's oath-bound to her promise. She's lying, obviously. That's only something you do if your life depends on it. Yep. An oath is an art that takes complex rituals and lots of hard work and time. Hardly worth the trouble, to be honest. I told you already. She wants to take you away from us. Women are creatures of deceit, boy. If you say so... She's right. Of course that goes doubly so for Velvet the Vengeful Villainess. Well, I won't deny it. Earn a new title. Oh, oh, he, so she just, she just has all the, oh, okay, let's just give Elnor and Loveset all the titles. Cool, cool. I want to end things off now, but first I would like to, uh, you know, go to fashion here. Go all the way to Eleanor. Hey, she level 22, dude. All right. I forgot to click fashion, actually. That's how you do it. Man, just, there we go. All right, we can give her a top hat. We can give her this hat. We can give her this thing, this, or these. Well, let's work with that after we get the outfit together. Holy fork, that doesn't look that different. Oh, that's why, because her hair... Of course, this uh, the hat style is just her hair pushed back. That's all. Anyway, we got the Japan style, we got the uh, the Legsy style, and we got the Menagerie style. Well, for uh, I I might go in Menagerie, but I want to see what looks better for her face. You know what? You know, you know what I mean, right? Oh my gosh! Whoa! Hang on. Yep, we're going with this. We're going with this. I, I can't. I can't not go with it. Oh man, the, the whole th the whole thing just goes together. See, this is nice. This is a nice hairstyle. But dude, dude, this this is it right here. This is the stuff. This. Is, oh my gosh, this is complete. All right, well, what, what, what can we give her? What, what can we? I mean, this kind of looks good on her. Kinda, not really. Nope. That thing still doesn't look good at all. Eh, nope. Hold on, hang on, guys. This, this is gonna be. Oh, let's be. This is. We're gonna. We're gonna find something for it. That. That almost looked good. Almost. It was close. That. It. It, it came in close, but nope. Wasn't. Wasn't there. Yep. These glasses kind of go with her too, but we already got someone on the team on the team that has glasses, so eh, not worth it. Oh. My gosh, this hat, this hat just might, you know, it just might go with her outfit, almost, actually, or that, oh my gosh, or even this, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, no, it looks dumb, all right, well, there you go, we have Eleanor, a new member of the team, also, I want to fix up Aizen real quick before anything's off, I'm going to get rid of this earring. All right, that's gonna be it for this episode. For all you lovely folk out there, I've been your favorite uh, Let's Player. Just kidding. 
Uh, but I've been Babadab, and I'll see you lovely folk in the next video.